Hey YouTube, how's it going? We are going to get right to it. Today we are unboxing and taking a look at the Phase 5 weapon systems. It is a, what they call a UMS. It's a universal mini stock. And it's made by Phase 5. And we're just going to go ahead and uh, unbox it. Take a look at it. And install it and see what it uh what it's all about and how the look and feel is. So let's go ahead and take this apart. Right off the bat it is a uh, very, very well made. It's a uh, billet aluminum, it looks like. And uh so you can take a look at it. It's got an installation screw there. Two of them to install right in your stock. And it looks like it just directly mounts right into it. Comes with an Allen key. And those of you who are not familiar with this, it's a, it's a universal mini stock. It's a fixed stock solution for your rifle. Um, it fits on a variety of buffer tubes and uh, receiver extensions. Uh, what we have today is a Cobra Tech, uh buffer tube kit mounted on a uh, lower and we're just going to go ahead and mount it there. It's, um, it, it's compatible all the six position uh, carbine receiver extensions. Um, phase 5 makes a hex 1 buffer tube, it fits on that. They also make a hex 2 buffer tube, it fits on that as well. And uh, basically any uh, cylindrical buffer tube between 1.1 1 .1 and 1.25 OD inches should be fine. Um, it's made in the USA and it's made out of 6061 T6 aluminum and uh, they claim, phase 5 claims it's 5.7 ounces. We're going to go ahead and uh, weigh it now and see what we got. Let's go ahead and come over here to our scale. turn that on and see what we are looking at. It's definitely an ultralight setup. Yeah, scale says 6.17 ounces, so uh, they said it's 5.7, a little bit off, but yeah, it's only 0.3 ounces, not too bad. All right, let's go ahead and mount it onto the receiver. It looks like it's uh, pretty easy to go. So, if you've got a stock, you're going to want to remove it, obviously. And this should be uh, cut and dry. It fits right over your stock. So, you just slide it over and install. Tighten down the uh, set screws that come with it into the lock position there. I would use Loctite as these things tend to uh, wobble and get loose. You bring it down to the bottom and got the first one in there and that is pretty rock solid. Go ahead and take the uh, second one. I will put a little bit of Loctite there and I would tighten these to about 10 or 15 pounds with blue Loctite. This final one here is now pretty much bottomed out. Um, Again, I would use blue Loctite on these two screws, the set screws, and this is what it looks like. It's pretty nice.
shoulders pretty well. It's pretty comfortable. And I think that's uh, pretty nice. It's got a nice balance. It's not uh, too heavy. It's not too light back there. It's nice. It feels nice and balanced in your hand. And it is a fixed length, obviously, which um, is pretty good. It's a pretty good shoulder. So there you have it. I hope you liked the review.